All right, hello America, hello New York City, hello Streetsboro. Um, I just wanted to say a Venezuelan guy said he got a, he wanted to talk to me, he needed to tell me some things, it's really important. So last night we spoke and he was telling me, you know, that he thought what I was doing was very important. He was saying that his Venezuelan countrymen have got to be stopped. They were raised in Venezuela to hate Americans ever since they were born and their parents were um, raised to hate Americans by Chavez and now Maduro. That there's China is in Venezuela, also Hezbollah, um, the Russians, everyone that wants to destroy uh, America, but they can't do it from the outside. So they have to send people in here to do it from the inside. And he said that the hatefulness that are from his countrymen for this country is unbearable. I asked him what he thought about them taking over the Dominicans over in uh, Washington Heights for the dope game. He said, absolutely, they're desperate. These guys are hardcore hardcore gang members uh mutilating people just their reputation is will is renowned through the world and if they get weapons it's over it's a wrap that the dominicans won't stand a chance against the venezuelans but he wasn't saying it because he's a venezuelan ah we're gonna win he's saying that it, it'll be a wrap if they get their hands on the weapons because they have nowhere to return they come from nothing he was also saying that he believes joe biden is evil and that he wants to re re remain in power and he wants his people to remain in power. Um, that they want to, I ask, take, ask him, take out the, the Republicans for good, possibly wipe them out. And he was saying, in his opinion, yes, um, by any means necessary so that the Democrats can bring in lawlessness. And for those of you that are spiritual minded, you can understand lawlessness, no rules, no, that the dark when i speak of a dark path we're going down a huge dark path this guy was talking about uh the vicious things that he had seen in venezuela and he loves this country very much as some people that have come here from venezuela for many years ago told me they're very scared of their countrymen and they came to america and they love it and they wanted to escape them not maduro himself as much as the countrymen that they're totally uh, scared of i want to thank that venezuelan man who got a hold of me and uh, he's very scared for this country, as many foreigners are, that um, the Venezuelan men and the other migrants that are coming that hate this country with all their, their passion. Um, I asked him about the shot callers demanding money. Uh, I believe he said that, in his opinion, he thought that was absolutely true. Um, I told you about the Venezuelan lonely hard love scam, where the Venezuelan men try to find a woman to get to try to get everything, to try to get on the house deed, to try to get the credit cards, try to milk women for everything they can. Um, these guys are desperate and they have nowhere to go. And the migrant single men eviction notices within 60 days and these streets here are gonna be brutal when the migrant men get kicked out of the shelters and have to go to the street with the homeless guys that are already angry. And people are gonna be competing for benches, selling cigarettes, selling dope, selling needles, shooting dope and all the stuff that's gonna go on in the street game here, it's gonna be really bad.